get them, spin them, but lunch in my shoe on the denim. I put the records on them, big bands can't bend them. Ops. We hit What's up, divas and divos? The wig that I received is from a company that I worked with, I think, like, two or three times, like, last year. And their name is YG Wig. They sent me a lace front, wanted some color, so it's kind of similar to a color that I recently did. They sent me their 20-inch, and it is a lace front, and this is the color right here. This is a 20-inch Blueless Dream lace wig. It's a body wig. I had to use um, a spray on it. This one is an aerosol can. It was $10. I purchased this from eBay. I sprayed it on this wig only because the lace was really light, like overly light. Like I know my scalp is light, but there's no way that this was going to work out for me. I did try to tweeze some of the knots, but because it was already colored, there wasn't any type of way for me to lift the knots. Trust me, I tried. A girl did try. I did sew an elastic band in this unit and that's about it. And I did style it. It took me a minute to style this hair because it was very dry. I had to press it with the hot, with the flat iron and use my comb to pass through it. And there are flyaways on this unit, but you know, we're just gonna work this out to the best of my ability. The spray actually dries really easy. I don't see any type of color rubbing off. This was last night when I did it. So I'm just gonna show you how your wig comes and then we just gonna get into this video, okay? When you receive your unit from YG Wigs, it will come in their standard black box packaging. So receive a thank you brochure which will show you how to care for your unit along with that a wig cap which will protect your hair. In the unit packaging you will also receive some extra combs along with that an elastic band and some hair clips to help you style your hair. YG Wigs will also pr provide a wig bag, which is more or less like a tote bag. You will also see their earn $20 cash back if you review their units on Facebook, YouTube, or Instagram. The unit that I received is a 20 inch, 180% 13 by six Peruvian body wave. And this is in the color number four. The lace that I have is in a color light brown. Due to the fact that this unit has already been colored, I will not be able to lift any of the knot. The lace is very light in color. As you guys can tell, this is a light brown. The unit did come pre-styled, but I would highly advise you to pre-wash, pre-condition, or co-wash your unit, as you will see or notice that the hair texture will change. I'll leave all of the information for YG Wigs down below, where you can follow them on all of their social media and check out all of their units available. Okay, you guys, so let's get into this tutorial. I will apologize in advance if my mirror is kind of like in front of me because listen, this is all backwards, but I'm gonna try my best to pull it forward so that way it's not blocking too much of the view and you know, we just gonna do this. So you guys, I'm gonna apologize in advance because due to the color of my video, this was when I first did my setup over and unfortunately, I did forget that I had on a UV lens protector cap on my lens for the past like two and a half three years not knowing that i totally forgot i went to clean my lens and realized that this was over it and this too needed to be cleaned so i did remove it probably like four videos after shooting this one so this is actually a mishap of mine and i do apologize for the color but just bear with me okay so as you guys see i'm just doing the usual i'm just cutting the lace off of the unit and because I was not able to bleach the knots because the hair was already colored for me unfortunately I'm going to have to camouflage the hairline as much as possible 
So the first thing I'm going to start off with is making me some baby hairs for this because girl, this lace is definitely not going to melt into my hair or my skin or my line, my scalp or any of that. And I'm so happy that I did purchase the even, <clears throat> excuse me. I'm so happy that I did purchase the Even New York Aerosol Can Hairspray, but I will give you guys a little bit of advice about that hairspray or that tinting spray. It is in an aerosol can, so it does not come out like a wet formula as you would purchase one of the Tailored Crowns tinting sprays. This spray does dry really quick because it is in an aerosol can, but to me, it kind of gives it almost like a little chalky um, filter over the actual lace it does not drip when or or stain your skin when you apply hairspray that is one good thing as you see me doing here but it does kind of give it like a chalky kind of like look to me that's just in my opinion now the reason why I'm doing this a little bit backwards today is normally I don't cut the hairs you know of the baby hairs or the wispy hairs I normally will just leave them you know long until after I have adhered the wig but I wanted to show you guys how it is when I've already cut the hair. Like, you know, I've already wore the wig and now I want to put it back on. This is how I have to do it once the hair is already cut and the lace is already cut. This is how I have to apply the unit. I have to hold down the baby hairs and I have to kind of like repart it. So it is a little bit more challenging to reapply it. But that is the reason why I do cut the baby hair is in the front line of the hair. I cut all of them. Even though I don't use them all, it's only because when you reapply it, you're definitely not going to be able to um well, basically, you want to just cut enough baby hair so when you do reapply it, you'll have baby hairs. They're not always going to be in the same spot, so that's the reason why I cut all of them. I don't use them all, but this is how I will reapply my baby hairs or excuse me, but reapply my lace front wig. So I'm going to go ahead and use my Dollar Tree styling mousse. And this stuff is amazing. It's only a dollar. This product has been around forever. My mama told me this, okay? So it's not really a Dollar Tree product product, but girl, it works so good for a dollar. So I suggest you guys get you some whenever you guys can get out don't make it like a priority now everything is basically on lockdown so i just want you guys to more or less be safe out there and be very careful of what you do as you guys will see you know we can just stay at home and we can perfect our wig skills or our makeup skills you know just have some fun while you're in the house try not to overstress yourself about this situation that we all are in i know it has really really um, got my anxiety levels to the max and that's unfortunate for those who do have anxiety um, certain situations do worry me a lot okay so I went ahead and uh, hot combed the part over to the left side because the way the lace is you're definitely gonna have to camouflage it and I really would not advise to put a dead smack middle part because it's so noticeable in the middle you know people give you eye contact so definitely don't put it in the middle being that I don't like the hair like kind of flat like this I'm just going to be using a new barrel curler a new hot curler that I received so I was gifted this by Chi and it also was gifted to me by Octoly in return for an unbiased honest review it does go up to 450 degrees I did use it to curl a wig the other day and they also did send me some products to go along with it which is their iron guard and they also did send me their Invero 54 hairspray this has a natural hold like I said I did use it it does have an LED screen once this light right here this little LED light stops blinking that means that the temperature is at its fullest its max and you can use it so as I was saying you guys just please be cautious out there and try not to overstress yourselves <clears throat> excuse me try not to overstress yourselves I know that this is a very worrying worrisome time but I just want you guys to know that I'm praying for all of you guys and I just want you all to be safe you guys are all in my prayers please be safe you know be be courteous to others as always you know and just please be very cautious 
try not to let this get you too down. You know, it's okay to be in the house. You know, we get to learn who we are as people as well as our loved ones and just take this time to get to know one another. So as you guys see, I'm just going to continue to curl my hair. I really do like this curling barrel, but it does take some getting used to being that, you know, I'm used to a wand, but it's not too bad. You know, it does give really, really good curls. And you just want to make sure when you're doing your curls that you're pinning them so that way they don't fall or at least holding them for at least a good 15 seconds. Okay, you guys. Um, this is a one and a half inch barrel and she does have some really great products. So this barrel I am do liking a lot. I'm just not like one for hot curling my hair on camera. I find it much easier to do it on the mannequin. But she came out much better as a side part versus a middle. let me tell you guys this was a challenge the wig the video setup it was a challenge actually after i parted it on the opposite side it looks a whole lot better like meaning not in the middle it just looks a lot better to me the lace is a little bit on the thicker side if i had not put it on without the spray it would have been more or less very white on my skin complexion so there are a little bit of short hairs throughout the unit which i had to use a wax stick just to tame them the hair is more or less one length this is supposed to be 20 inches they did say they were sending me 20 inches i don't really think this is 20 i'm really gearing more towards 22 inches. If this is their 20 inches, then honey, thank you, okay? Because a lot of times 20 inches does not look like this, okay? You pay for the length. So if this is 20 inches, then girl, thank you. As far as the cap size, it does fit very snug. It fits very comfortable. It's definitely if you put an elastic band with it. The combs and adjustable strap were all in the right place, okay? So I give them that. The hair texture is very low on the luster side. I think it's kind of dry to me, so I would definitely kind of like deep condition it. Other than that, the color is gorgeous, though. This is a color number four. I love this type of color. It's a very natural color. It matches my freckles, even though you can't see them on camera because I have makeup on, but I like this color. It suits me well. I wish that the roots would have been in its natural state, so that way I could have lifted the color, the, the knots, but you know... You win some, you lose some. So I did the best that I could. I had to put baby hairs in it because I definitely had to hide the lace. And I hope the video came out crispy clear. I'm just trying out new things, so just bear with me. But you can check out YG Wig. I will post their information down below for this unit. I apologize if I keep looking to the right of me. It's because that's where my monitor is at. But yeah, I love you guys. Stay deep and deep delicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. All the information and links for every product that I use in this video will be posted down below. Share this video with everybody that you know. And on that note, I gotta go. Guys, to do me another video. My rhyming skills are really pulling up there, guys. You know? I'm about to come out with a record. Get him, spin him, unless I'm shooting a denim. I put the records on him. Big mans can't bend him. Ops, we hit him. Fuck him off, he's venom.